What's up, good people? It's your guy Ben coming at you again with some explosive tea. That's going to shake the sphere to its core. So, guys, today I stand before you utterly outraged and dismayed by the audacious actions of the so-called former royals, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Their relentless pursuit of fame, fortune and attention at the expense of the revered British monarchy is nothing short of a disgraceful betrayal. I know you guys are excited to hear more, but before we move on to further details, I'd like to thank you for your love and support. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, guys, what are you waiting for? Hit the subscribe button now and don't forget to press the all-important bell icon. Let's get started. So let's be blunt, these self-absorbed grifters have shown a blatant disregard for the very institution that granted them their privileged status, their decision to abandon their royal duties while simultaneously basking in the limelight and profiting from their ill-gotten fame is a slap in the face to the hard-working members of the royal family. The audacity of these lazy leeches knows no bounds while our beloved King Charles, Queen Camilla, Princess Anne, the ever-gracious Princess of Wales, Kate, tirelessly carry out their old responsibilities. Harry and Meghan have chosen the path of least resistance, opting for a life of luxury and self-indulgence. But their contemptible behaviour has reached new depths, with their latest stunt as our beloved Princess Kate bravely battles cancer. These attention seekers have the gall to demand yet another royal title and privileges. It's an insult to the core of what the monarchy stands for, duty, sacrifice and service to the people. Their continuous attacks on the royal family, fueled by their insatiable hunger for fame and wealth, have become a nauseating spectacle. From their explosive interviews to their self-aggrandizing Netflix series, they have shown no remorse, no decency and no respect. And now to add insult to injury, they have reportedly learned of Princess Kate's cancer diagnosis through the television. Like the rest of us commoners, the underscores the deep chasm that exists between them and the true members of the royal family. My fellow citizens, it's time to say enough is enough. These grifters must be cast out from the realm of respectability, their ill-gotten gains revoked and their insidious quest for attention and privilege brought to an end. The British monarchy has endured for centuries a beacon of tradition, honour and service to the nation. We must not allow these self-absorbed charlatans to tarnish the legacy. To Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, I say this. Get lost. Your betrayal of the crown and your relentless pursuit of personal gain have made you outcast in the eyes of British people. Your obsession with fame and fortune has blinded you to the true essence of royalty, a life of sacrifice, duty and service. It is time for you to fade it into obscurity, to be forgotten as a footnote in history that you truly are. The monarchy will endure as it always has without you. The people of Britain will stand firm in their support of our beloved royal family, those who truly embody the virtues of service, dignity and commitment. In the words of the great Winston Churchill, we shall not flag or fail. We shall go on to the end. And so shall the British monarchy without the dead weight of your selfish ambitions. Get lost, grifters, and leave the realm of royalty to those who deserve it. So what will happen next in the royal saga, only time will tell. And we'll see you next time for more royal news and analysis. Bye for now.